right, time to bring in our secret, <laughs> secret chef, Billy, onto the show. Uh, welcome. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for, for having us. this segment, yeah. by the way. <laughs> he is, for sure. Uh, let's talk about Secret Chef. Yes, sir. How did you get started? Uh, we started uh, 12 years ago. We developed that out of a catering business that we still have, Secret Chef Catering now. Mm -hmm. But uh, originally before that, we had a bed and breakfast in downtown Waco. And then we catered out of that, and then it developed into Secret Chef. So, so. you're into hospitality and making people feel good. Yes. I can tell by the way you plate your food, because these are your healthy meals. Yes. But I think just psychologically, like sitting down to this, I'm not thinking I'm on a diet. Right. I'm having a great meal. Right. Like I told you earlier, I literally took one of our our meals that, that comes in, the fit meals that comes in a package just mm -hmm. like this. It's microwavable. Yeah. I put it on a plate just like that. And all you have to do is warm it up. It's so pretty. It's an art. It is so. Art. Yeah. And I'm impressed with the uh, the um, diverse selection you mm -hmm. have here. Yes. You've got everything from you know chicken. You've got some pot roast over there. Your best seller here. Let's tell everybody here is this. And I didn't know this was chicken salad. Chicken salad. We Why sell do you think so that many. Is? Just it's a great easy lunch. Yeah. It's a great snack. It's great for a party. It's great for uh, giving to a friend. Yep. It's just uh, the kids will grab it. You're, everybody eats it, um, and we just sell so much of that. We just kind of become famous for that. Yum. Um, it's just good to have chicken salad in the house just to grab. We talked about this before the show about time management. Why do people come to you? Is it because they want good food, or is it they just don't have time to make it? Do they, don't have, they don't have time. They're busy. They're running their kids, like you said, to a practice. They're running uh, all around, and then we also have a large segment of our customer base that is elderly. Yeah. They can't get in the kitchen anymore. Yeah. They can't maneuver. They can't get to the store. So their kids come and get it, or they come and get it, and they have meals ready to go. So they'll come for and buy week. for the week, three or four days at a time, and they buy that. And that way, they're eating a full meal. Yeah. It's because yeah. a lot of people in an older age group aren't eating. So we have a large, yeah. a large group of those people that come in to um, help. Um, yeah. You know, serve yeah. what serve what they have. So you've got things in the case all the time, like yes. chicken salad, but then you have some rotating items too. Yes. Right? Everything you see here is in the case all the time. Okay. In the store, we do a meal every day, like last night, uh, Tuesday night was chicken fried steak with green beans and mashed potatoes, just that yeah. traditional thing. Mm -hmm. You know, tonight was uh, spiral sliced ham with broccoli and rice casserole and some sweet potatoes. And so every night we do something different. Mm -hmm. It changes every week. I love it. And then we have all of our standard stuff. We have our fit meals, so you can, some of your family that needs to eat fit or healthy, yeah. have dietary restrictions, we've got that. And then Dessert. we have the chocolate cream pie for traditional, or we got roast and chicken spaghetti, and we got all the kind of things you can get, you can feed you and the kids right here. That way you can be the short order cook and not be a short order cook. Yeah, for it. sure. That's a sexy little number over there, that pie. Chocolate cream that, pie. It's almost too pretty to eat. And it has a sister coconut cream pie, too. Okay. So. That's my favorite. Uh, I want to tear into these gooey bars real quick. Uh, talk, let's talk about that. What, what is this? It is a cookie base, cookie cake base with cream cheese and powdered sugar, butter, and eggs on top. Is it good? See, I'm not a chocolate person. I'll always go for something like this or something fruity. So this sounds yeah. right up my alley. Those are very sweet. Everyone in my family loves chocolate, though. So. Right. Yeah. As you take a break, we come back. We'll kind of mm. dig into one of these. I got my eye on that thing over so there. So good. We'll talk about that. Plus, we have <laughs> okay. an Army military veteran who's going to talk about his book, Overcome. We do all that. We come back. Stick around.